everyone, tonight I decided to make uh, the Italian castagnaccio. Basically, we need, we need just uh, um, chestnut flour. Let's go get it about two cup, one cup, and uh, two cup. Maybe a little bit more. Let's go make a little bit more castagnaccio tonight for all the family. Now we get we add uh, one cup of water, a pinch of salt. We mix all together. Ah, we need more water. You have to be a little bit liquid, not too much. Uh, there you go, so we mix all together very nice. There you go. We did a little bit more water. Let's just say about two cups of water, cold water. We mix all together. In the same in the in the meantime. We do the oven, we put the oven on about 375 so it can be warm. Go. Now we add uh, some uh, raisin or uh, you can add the walnuts. Let's go say about uh, half cup. There you go. Mix all together. With the other pan, we put some uh, olive oil or spray, whatever you prefer. Everything over here. There we go, perfect. Now we put some fresh olive oil on top, like let's go say about two tablespoons, fresh rosemary for flavor. Now we can put in the oven for about uh, one hour, one hour and fifteen yeah, minutes. Let's check about our castagnaccio. Yes, it's ready. The color is a beautiful, crispy. It looks like very crispy. Okay. Let's go. Be careful because it's very, very hot. Okay. Okay. Now we can cut. So good. I can't wait to taste. And uh, mm, so good. And voila, enjoy Italian castagnaccio.